Okay, here we have our west end loop trailing point signal for the main line. Operation of this signal is pretty much the same as the last one I showed you, except this is a searchlight instead of a three light. So here's the operation of the searchlight. train passes it will downgrade to a stop now this particular signal will not upgrade to an approach it will go straight to a clear this is because I do not have all of the circuitry finished yet I still have to install more detector circuits so for now it just upgrades to a clear now let's take a look at the facing point signal at this interlocking. Okay, basic operation of this signal is pretty much the same as the last one and the first one I showed you, except this one is completely wired. Uh, this one will show the approach as well. Um, this one will also show other indications which I will show later, but there still needs to be one detector circuit installed for the diverging indication to work properly. So here's a demonstration of this signal. I'm only using two engines for this train just to save us some time here. circuits as soon as the train passes it, it will downgrade to a stop indication, as it just did. And if you can see in the distance, my intermediate signal lit up, which I will go into detail on these later. Now once it enters the next block, and exits the preceding block, it will go to the approach indication. And once it leaves the second block, it will upgrade to a clear. And there you have it. Now let's take a look at this signal when the direction is reversed. It's pretty much going to operate the same as our east end loop signal. It goes immediately to red as soon as I reverse the direction and give the throttle and it will remain this way until either direction is reversed to favor the signal or if I de-throttle the train. Here we have a light engine move, westbound movement. As demonstration for you today. And there you have it. Okay, now we have our 
west end loop interlocking signal, our two target dwarf. Right now it is showing a yellow over flashing red. Now, a little FYI, this circuit here has a minor malfunction. It's supposed to be showing a green over flashing red, but hey, I'm not a perfect circuit builder. builder. Now let's see a video of the signal in operation. Now the current is reversed against the signal, so it will go to red as soon as I give the train throttle. As it goes there. Also note too, and I'll show you our facing point signal is now showing a medium approach medium. Now when the switch at the east end loop is thrown against the branch it will show a medium approach. In this case both switches are favoring the branch so it's a medium approach medium. Now let's take a look at the dwarf signal in the favoring direction. Right, now we see our signal in the favoring direction. When did you buy that pop? Once the train passes it, it will go to a red. And that's our dwarf signal.